Welcome back to At Your Leisure. I'm Katie Yardley and this is my husband, Mark. Thank you. I'm here for the samples and to do whatever Katie needs me to do. Thanks for having me. Welcome to Katie's Kitchen. Today, we are going to be cooking a biscuits and gravy casserole. This is one of our favorites. Whenever we go to the lake, everybody just loves it. We hope you love it too. Let's start with the recipe. Biscuits and gravy casserole ingredients. One can Pillsbury Grand's biscuits cut in quarters. One pound breakfast sausage, eight eggs, a half a cup of half and half, salt and pepper to taste, two to three cups grated cheddar cheese. For the gravy, four tablespoons butter, four tablespoons flour, two to three cups milk for your desired consistency, salt and pepper to taste. Bake at 350 degrees for 30 minutes or until eggs are fully cooked. So there is nothing better when you're out on the lake on the houseboat. I start cooking this in the morning. It's so simple and so easy, but I'll tell you right now, I don't even get halfway through before everybody's up. They know exactly what I'm cooking for breakfast. While your sausage is cooking, you wanna take your cut up pieces of your biscuit and you want to layer or just kind of sprinkle them all over the bottom of your casserole dish. Doesn't have to be fancy. Do just they need to be there. cooked? No, no, they don't need to be cooked. It all bakes together in one casserole. This is how easy this dish really is. Wow. Once the sausage is browned, I like to use the slotted spoon so I can actually leave a lot of the grease into the bottom of the pan. And then I just drain a little bit off or shake it a little bit off and then I sprinkle it over the biscuits that are in the bottom. If you could only smell it, you wanna take your eggs, beat them up really good, add your half and half, beat that in really nice, a little bit of salt, a little bit of pepper. All right. We pour that right over on top of all of the biscuits, the sausage. So we put about two to three cups of cheese on top. All right, so let's just take and we'll pour it all over. All right. Amazing. Would you mind opening the oven door for me, honey? I'd love to. All right, we'll put this in the oven, 350 degrees for 30 minutes, or until the eggs are fully cooked. Are you hungry yet? Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> yes I am. All right, well in that case, honey, will you open the oven for oh, me? Oh, I would love to. <laughs> the question I have is, is am I gonna be able to sneak a little bit of this out of here? No. <laughs> like, why if not? Well, if you want to sneak some out right now, feel free to burn your tongue. <laughs> so I yeah, don't well, want to do that. Yeah, when, when you take it out of the oven, you want to so let it good. you want to let it rest for about 10 to 15 minutes before you cut it up and serve it. Also, very important on your casserole dish, make sure you spray it or butter it so that everything doesn't stick to it. But uh, yeah, 10 to 15 minutes, and we'll be eating. <laughs> Looking good. You have definitely got to try this recipe. It is so perfect for camping, for the boat, when you're out on the lake, at home, any day of the week, actually. Ooh, that's a big bite. Mm. It's going to be hot. It's amazing how all oh the flavors, gosh. I just can't believe how they just all go together so good. It's his favorite, so. Anyway, we'll be right back with more At Your Leisure. <laughs> 